tidy. Right, magic in our way over to my world, is it? Hmm, now let's see. What is it? You got a wand somewhere by here? We can't go casting spells without a wand now, can we? A wand? Why would we have a wand? Oh, that's a pain. Ah, well, can't be helped. We just have to look for one outside. Huh? We won't find one out there either. Don't nitpick, crybaby bunting. Bunting? My name is Oliver. Oliver. Ah, so the crybaby bit was right at least, was it? Ah. Uh. Easter eggs. <sighs> Great. and sticky that really doesn't sound very pleasant okay so I'll find a stick You would think that uh, we'd just be able to find a stick basically by a tree, but... Well, at least it'll tell us where we need to go, so... Okay, let's see if there's uh, something that we can put in there.
Okay. Well, I don't know, why don't you give me a shot? that there was something I could get here, but... I don't think that there's anything here for me to pick up. Kinda wish there was, but you know, well, so. You're, you're the little girl I met before, huh? Mm-hmm. We met before. So, how do you know who I am? I'm really, really sorry, Oliver. Huh? Your mummy. I'm sorry. I couldn't save her. Huh? I don't... Why would you be sorry for that? I wanted to save her. I really did. Huh? Hey, wait. Where are you... going? Hey, where did you go? Ollie boy, why are you talking to thin air? Mr. Drippy, she disappeared again. Huh? Who did? That strange girl. That's the second time she tried to talk to me. What's that? A girl? Where? You're right about strange. I can't see her any flipping where. Well, how could you? She disappeared into thin air. Well, anyway, there's something I want to ask you. There is? Uh, sure. Go ahead. Do you mind it? You know, having a sidekick, like. Huh? A sidekick? Who do you mean? Crikey, that's cold. Who do you mean, he says? Why not stab me in the heart while you're at it? I mean me. I wanted to know if it was all right me joining you on your adventures. Or if you were maybe wanting to trade me in for a younger, prettier model. But it looks like I got my answer, huh? Well, so you know, if you don't have faith in people, you'll never see their true worth. And what's more? Look at this. Huh? It was on the ground, right where that girl was standing. Chuck it here, then. Top. Well, I'll be a monkey's uncle. It's a wand. You mean it? A real wand? Come over by here and take a look, man. It might seem like any old stick, but it's got all magic writing on it, see? It does, huh? Wow. Is that how people write in your world? The runes are all faded, so it might have lost a bit of power. But for our current purposes, it's a beauty. Neato. What a stroke of luck. Luckier than you know, Ollie boy. Do I never thought we'd actually find one. Do you think maybe that girl brought it here for me? Right, now we need a place to cast our spell. To 
cask gateway, you need somewhere proper massive. You need space to give it oomph, see? Do we really need that much oomph? Yeah, what kind of question is that? Magic is special, innit? It's sacred, right? You have to cast spells in the best environment possible. You really are new to this, aren't you? This is beginner stuff we're talking about here. Oh, uh, sorry. Now, take me somewhere with plenty of space. It's got to be somewhere around by you. Um, the town square, I guess. And the town square is really north of us, so... I could probably talk to those people. Do you really think we should be doing this here? No worries, man. Normal people can't see magic, see? Go on, Ollie boy. Cast gateway. Um... Okay. Shunt in, crybaby bunting. For the last time, it's Oliver! Hey, it's not bad work for a crybaby, this. Oh. Luckily, nobody actually saw him, like, uh, going upwards while he walked. And we're off to another world! Hey, wait! Wait for me! Shall we? Huh? Hey, wait for me! <sighs> so this is... your world. Ah, home at last! But there's a tidy way to go yet. Hey, Mr. Drippy, that was pretty neat just now, huh? Oh, that herd of elk! Enjoy your first encounter with the majestic wildlife of our mysterious world, did you? Uh-huh. Huh? Jeepers. Oh, Nickers! Where did he spring from? Ah. Ah. What do we do? He's not like the big softies just now. He's itching for a fight. Proper savage. Let's run away. No, use that stick you got by there. Give him a whacking and send him packing. Huh? Huh? <laughs> ah. Look lively, he's making his move. Let's do it! Yeah, we're gonna beat an enemy with a stick. Or hit points.
Okay, I don't get that expression. Bob's your uncle. Nice one, Oddie boy. Jeepers creepers. Oh yeah, I forgot to mention. Our world is absolutely riddled with beasties. But keep that up and you'll have nothing to worry about. Right, let's get a move on, shall we? Sure, Mr. Drippy. But where are we going? Well, first off, we need to get you a wand. But I already have a wand. You're having a laugh, aren't you? That thing's about as magical as a flipping cabbage. You might just squeeze a gateway spell out of it, <laughs> but you can forget about anything more than that. Honestly, I wish you'd think before you open your mouth. Oh, uh, sorry. Now, I told you Ding Dong Dell was just over by yonder, didn't I? Well, if we're very lucky, we might find a wand with a bit more oomph down by there. So, are wands really so hard to find here? Well, time was you couldn't move for the flipping things, but since Shada showed up, Magic's taken a real nosedive. He banned people from using it, see? Cursed anyone who tried to. He scared them all so much they gave it up. So, he's pretty scary, huh? Well, he turned me into a flipping doll, didn't he? Just saying his name's enough to make most folks brick it. Still, I'd rather be a doll than have him go poking round in my heart. No one wants to be broken-hearted. Broken-hearted? Like, sad? Worse than that, much worse. It's when he steals a piece of a person's heart. Poor beggars don't know whether they're alive or dead. That's no way to live, man. So that's why they're all so scared of him, huh? We can't let him go on doing this. Well, it's not a matter of letting him, is it? It's not like people flipping enjoy it. That's why I brought you here, innit? You might just be able to stop him, see? You really think I can? Of course you can! You are the pure-hearted one! And the legends say that the pure-hearted one will drive away the darkness! We'll teach you a few tasty spells and you'll be ready to face him in no time! Sound good to you? Okay, I'll do it. I'll learn magic. Of course you will! And that's why we need to find you a better wand! All right. Let's head for Ding Dong Dell. Tidy! Sounds good. Yeah, so basically don't turn your back on any of the enemies. Uh, three bread. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
Okay, here in the overworld, it's uh, actually pretty hard to see enemies. At least I think so, so. Um, there's where Ding Nong Dell is, uh, is at, so that's uh, gonna be the first place that we're really gonna head to, but, um, what I am gonna do, um, right now, um, I think, uh, between this recording session and, uh, my next one, um, I'm gonna be finding some enemies out here, and, uh, I'm gonna be gaining a couple of levels, um, I'm hoping to be at levels, uh, either five or seven by the time that I have to actually head up to Ding Dong Dell, so, um, Right now, I think <coughs> I'm still at like level one, so, um, but anyways, uh, I'm gonna sign off for now. This is Vizzle 15, you've been watching Let's Play Nino Kuni, and, uh, I will see you later.